All right, aside from the big game this weekend, you've got it being Groundhog Day on Sunday. Yeah, my mom has been saying over and over again, I think it's a joke, but she says, they should reschedule the big game because it's Groundhog's Day. No one That's really not a cares. holiday. No one really cares about Groundhog's Day, what let's be honest. Groundhog Day does, it brings up Punxsutawney Phil. Yes. But also makes us have to watch the movie Groundhog Day. Oh, yeah. Starring Bill Murray. Bill Murray. All right, some things about the movie you probably didn't know. Mm -hmm. The best line in the movie, uh, the line about... Um, I don't know where you're headed, but can you call in sick? That was Ned and, and Bill's character, Phil. Uh, that was an ad lib. Yeah, an ad lib. So it wasn't in the script. He just made it up. A movie made in Illinois, not Pennsylvania. Mm -hmm. But there's a scene where, where Phil, Bill's yeah. character, steps into a, a, puddle. a, a pothole. Uh -huh. and, and they've got a plaque that says, Bill stepped here yeah, in so Illinois. They're really do, using their claim to fame for their 15 minutes. Uh, the movie was going to be originally about a spell. Yeah, in the script, it was yeah. going to. they were going to have an ex-lover named Stephanie cast a spell on... Mm. Uh, on Bill's character right. and then get him into this, you know, routine. But they decided to cross that out pretty quickly. Uh, first options were uh, Tom Hanks and Tori Amos in yeah. the movie, but that didn't work out. Okay. Um, a lot of the locals um, were were in the in the movie in yeah. Illinois, not Punxsutawney. Yeah, but the locals actually sued the movie company because they were saying we lost a lot of business while you were filming your thing here. Mm -hmm. They actually wanted twice what they would make in a yearly earning, which doesn't really make sense, but... Now it's a Starbucks. Um, to do the math, um, the original idea was for Phil to relive February 2nd for about 10,000 years. 10,000 years, but it actually yeah. ended up being about 10, 10 years. years. Um, the, the, the movie um, was uh, the first scene. Um, mm -hmm. Would have been Phil's typical day mm -hmm. with the audience eventually shown uh, how everything happened. Harold Ramis, the director who did uh, Ghostbusters and Caddyshack as well, uh, promised to not change his aspect of the script. But did so anyway, oh, thankfully. Okay. It, it, it did change some. Right. Um, apparently, the whole plan was to have Phil go and find the groundhog <laughs> and then kill in its lair. Okay. But they said, mm, no, too much like Caddyshack, oh, which yeah. Bill Murray was in yep. as a groundskeeper uh -huh. after a groundhog. <laughs> Probably should change that around. Yeah. Uh, and there's also <laughs> talk of it being a vampire um, yeah. Groundhog. After the director had an interview with a vampire, Reed, and it got him thinking, what would it be like to live forever? So they were thinking, vampire groundhog. Yeah. Interesting. So as you watch the movie Groundhog Day this uh, this weekend, remember the those 10 things about the movie that you Pretty probably didn't interesting. know. Want to read up and impress your friends right now? Get more info at the YesFM Facebook, Twitter at 967YesFM, and the Mers and Morning page at YesFM.com.